This video is some extra practice of rounding numbers. Specifically, in this case, we're rounding to the nearest tenth. The first thing we have to do is make sure we know where the tenth position is in the number. In this big number that I'm using as an example, the tenth is the first digit to the right of the decimal. For all numbers, when you want to find the tenth position, it's the first digit to the right of the decimal. So for all of these examples, that's the digit where we're focusing our attention. The first example is 84.62. The 6 is in the tenth position. And the number to the right of that 6 is a 2, which is smaller than 5, so we're rounding down. 84.6 is the answer when we round this number to the nearest tenth. In the second example, we have 217.41. The 4 is in the 10th position, and the number to the right of it is less than 5, so we're rounding down again. We have 217.4 as our answer. In this next example, we have 0 0.081. This 0 is in the 10th position, and the number after it is an 8. So that's bigger than 4, so we have to round up. 0 0.081 becomes 0 0.1 when rounded to the nearest 10th. The next example is 3.641. The 6 is in the 10th position. The number after it, to the right of it, is a 4, which is smaller than 5, so we will round down. We have 3.6 as our number rounded to the nearest tenth. Here we have 7.7089. This second 7 is in the 10th position, and the number after it is a 0, which is less than 5, so we round down. 7.7 .7 is our answer. In this last example, we have five. It's a bit of a trick question. There is no decimal showing and no digits to the right of the decimal. But if we want, we can write this as 5.000. We can put as many zeros as we want. But this zero that's in the 10th position is the one that we care about. The number to the right of it is another zero, which is less than five, so we round down. Our answer is 5.0. A student might be tempted to just write 5 as the answer and say, well, it's the same as 5.0, so it's rounded to the nearest tenth. But we want to show the tenth position when we're doing a rounding question. 